Okay, so I felt the need to make a spontaneous video. Um, I don't have my thoughts prepared, but I'm just gonna talk. Um, and I'm at a family's house, so I hope that no one wakes up and comes down and hears me. Um, anyway, that being said, I was just thinking about... <sighs> I just had, like, a moment where it, like, hit me all at once. Like, how rubbish, like, my Dean is right now. And it just, like, filled me with, like, dread and anxiety. Like, I literally, like, feel, like, this pressure on my chest because I know, like, how bad my Dean is right now. Um, and I just feel, like, very vulnerable. And, like, it's, like, all of a sudden realizing that, like, you're in the middle of, like, a field and there's, like, all these things approaching you and like you have no protection and like nowhere to run like that's kind of what I, I feel like right now like internally anyway but I just wanted to say that like I feel like a lot of people equate not being on Dean to like doing all these bad things or like sinning and like doing this and doing that and da 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 but sometimes like it's not even that like it's literally just like being caught up in life and like things going on so it's not like you're necessarily doing anything bad but you're not doing like the good things that you should be doing and that's still bad you know and that's kind of like where I struggle a lot is that like I don't notice it happening when it's happening because I'm not like out in the club or like you know doing like these haram things or whatever like it's not overtly like bad you know but it's just like I stray from like excuse me I stray from my like optimum levels of like closeness to Allah and subhanAllah like it happens so slowly that you don't even notice it happening and then one day you just like wake up and realize it and it's literally like a gut punch and I just feel like so guilty and bad and just like wrong like I just feel like yucky like and it's good like this is a good feeling like I'm glad that I feel this way because now I can say okay right how do I redirect myself how do I um straighten myself back out you know but it's just like being able to have that self-awareness to catch these things kind of when they come and also just remembering that like just because you're not doing bad things doesn't mean you're really doing good things either you know and I know that life can get busy and it can get hectic and we all have like a lot going on um but it's just like taking that time to recenter yourself and remember like what should be at the center of your life to then dictate everything else that you're doing um as opposed to trying to firefight all of these things in your life without a law like guiding you through like trying to do it on your own is literally a hot mess and that's probably why you're so tired and that's probably why you're so stressed out and why you're so like frazzled speaking to myself here and anyone else who might feel this way because when you're not following a law and you're just like following yourself like you don't know what you're doing like let's be real like as humans we don't have the all-knowing capacity of a law so wouldn't you want to follow the person that knows everything and like knows where you should be going a person but you know what i mean the one who knows everything and where you should be going and um following him and letting him lead the way as opposed to trying to follow yourself who is fallible and prone to mistakes and doesn't have the um holistic view of everything you can only see what's in front of you right whereas Allah can see the whole picture of you your life your past your present da -da 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 -da. um so yeah just a tip for anyone who might be in the same boat I'm gonna finish this I've already made wudu, I'm gonna finish this, and then I'm gonna go pray and try to like set the intention to recenter myself and like move forward from here. Um, so if you are feeling like that today and you want to do the same, I invite you to do so um, and let this be um, Allah's way of reminding you, like he reminded me through my <laughs> feelings of dread. <laughs>